Hey there, everybody. Seth Campbell here again with another Segway Says. Uh, I really should have you know those computer graphics. You know the word Segway Says kind of slide in. Some, but never mind. I'll handle that another time. In any case, uh, I wanted to do another one of the Segways I mentioned uh, on the Facebook post a while ago before I started doing the videos. Uh, so I can continue to explain all of those before I go into the new ones. And this this one's a little more jazz oriented. Uh, for, for folks who like jazz music a little more, and I, I should point out right from the start, I am terrible at playing jazz in general. I, I, I don't play jazz very well, so it's a, the simpler jazz tunes are, are the most you're, you're going to get from me. And this is one of those. So the two songs involved here are Maybe You'll Be There, which is a song uh, written by Rube Bloom and first recorded by Gordon Jenkins. Uh, but was brought to fame by folks like Sinatra, and it was one of the, you know, standard uh, jazz vocal pieces. And the second piece is called A Child is Born by Thad Jones, uh, brought to fame by the likes of Bill Evans and such, which is an instrumental jazz piece. And these two songs are in the same key, but they're in different time signatures. Uh, and for the uh, those of you who, who aren't, you know, big in music theory, that basically means that one of them is four beats per measure, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And the other is three beats per measure, so three, four, three out of four, so it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And the the difference makes this a little trickier, but it, it's still manageable. You basically, I mean, some songs change tempo right off, but this you can basically just slow one down a little bit and it makes it easy to transition to the others. So you have Maybe You'll Be There, which is a beautiful song that I highly recommend looking up. Um, and the uh, the last verse is where I'm going to focus because it goes into the into where I'm going to play Child is Born. It's, it's something like this. Um, Someday if all my prayers are answered hear a footstep on the stair With anxious heart I'll hurry to the door And maybe you'll be there And then if you're just playing it as that song, you could continue around and improvise over the chords or whatever you wanted to do. Now. A child is born, as I said, is in the same key, and it goes something like this. Let's see if I can still play this. That wasn't perfect, obviously. Um, there's another section, but for those of you who aren't interested in jazz, uh, I won't make you suffer through more of it. And for those of you who do like jazz, I won't make you suffer through more of my bad piano playing. So either way, you win. In any case, uh, so you have tunes that are in the same key, in the same sort of quiet feel. They're both in B-flat, both pretty melancholy. Uh, but they're in two different time signatures again. Um, uh, let's see. One, two... Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Then you've got one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So you want to switch between those two, and if you ask me, the easiest way to switch between time signatures is to bring one to a halt. Um, uh, to slow down the ending so that it allows for you to come in with a new time without it seeming so jarring. So what that would be, in this case, is uh, you, you slow down the 4-4 at the end and maybe you'll be there, like this. 
anxious heart, I'll hurry to the door. Maybe you'll be there. And it doesn't seem so staggering as if you were to just do it right on the downbeat, which would be, uh, I've never even tried this, so we're going to see together how this goes. With anxious heart, I'll hurry to the door, and maybe you'll be there. Which works, but it's harder to pull off. Um, it's not as smooth. So that way, you can go into a different time signature, so just slow it down till there isn't really a moving time anymore. So you, you almost stop it and start up again in a new time. And it works the other way as well. Get to the end of um, Child is Born and you can slow it down the same way. So uh, the ending uh, of that is... Uh, again, it's been a while since I played this. Uh... It's a lot it's not smoother when you allow for the slowdown. So that's how that one works. And um, barring any unforeseen developments, I think that's about as jazzy as the Segway Says uh, videos are going to get. Uh, so hopefully you've enjoyed it. And I'll, I will see you next time.